A turbofan engine has a large ducted fan in front. As the fan blades rotate, they draw in ambient air and accelerate its flow. The high speed air then enters the engine and splits into two streams. The first stream, called bypass air, flows around the core engine through the bypass duct and exits at the back of the engine. The bypass air produces up to 80% of the thrust and also helps cool the core engine. The second stream passes through the core engine. Inside the core engine, the air enters the compressor which consists of a series of fan blades. As the fan blades spin, they compress the incoming air, significantly raising its pressure and temperature. This step is crucial because compressed air burns fuel more effectively. Following compression, the high pressure air enters the combustion chamber, where it is mixed with fuel. The mixture is ignited, creating high temperature and high pressure gases. The hot gases produced in the combustion chamber rapidly expand and flow through the turbine, causing it to spin. The turbine is connected to a compressor and a fan through a shaft. As the turbine spins, it drives the compressor and the fan, allowing the cycle to continue. The jet of hot exhaust gases exits the engine's nozzle at high speed. The expelled exhaust gases, along with cold bypass air, push back against the engine generating thrust that propels the air line through the air. 